It's the dream of so many kids here in Texas, the chance to suit up and take the football field representing your school and your community. But for one Central Texan, suiting up just wasn't a possibility. That is until this week. 22 athletes taking the field in Gerald, running plays, making blocks, tackles. But the star of the show Thursday night was waiting on the sidelines. Meet Wyatt Camp. Dang, Wyatt's one of us. Uh, he's out here working out when we're out here working out. Um, and we see him through the hallways. He's always cheering us on. Wyatt was born with a rare chromosome disorder, IQ SEC2. He deals with extreme epilepsy and cerebral palsy. He's had four brain surgeries, but that hasn't stopped his love for the game. The coaches inviting him out to practices. Well, I was worried because I was like, is he in the way? And they're like, oh no, we want him. He, want him. he encourages our team, he encourages our players. But while he was part of the football family, Wyatt could never take the field himself. That is until Thursday night. We were a little bit in tears and we were a little uh, uh, taken aback. The coaches drawing up the perfect play as Wyatt carried the ball into the end zone. Touchdown! His teammates storming the field to celebrate his dad, nothing but smiles. That just was awesome. And it's been amazing to be able to share that with him and and get to you know put pads on him like my dad did whenever I was a little kid and, and first started seeking out. Wyatt's crew, his bus driver, teacher, and now his whole team celebrating a student who has overcome so much. And for his family, a memory that will last a lifetime. Okay. It's been pretty cool. We will probably watch it over and over and it will be shared on social media, probably not just by us, but by all of our friends and family over and over again. So will I, Wyatt. So will I.